Hi friends, welcome back to Learning Tajik with Achilles, where we teach Tajik and sometimes talk about the Tajik culture. My name is Hussein and my brother Hassan, he is filming this video. And today we will talk about the Valentine's Day since the next Monday will be February 14th, uh, Valentine's Day. We decided to make a video about this topic and also talk about the words that you can use, uh, like how to say I love you in Tajik and I miss you and some words related to the Valentine's Day, okay? So first we'll start with the day, the day when we celebrate the Valentine's Day. It's February 14th, right? So how to say February 14th in Tajik? We say Chordaumi Fevral. Chordaumi Fevral. So Chorda means 14 and Fevral it's February. If you don't know the numbers in Tajik or if you want to review, we have a video about that. You can watch that. And also about the ordinal numbers we have about, about that video as well. So, Chordaumi Fevral. Okay? Chordaumi Fevral. Okay, the next word is love. Love. And in Tajik we say Muhabbat. Muhabbat or Ishq at the end. But both of them are nouns. If you want to say that as a verb, for example, to love, uh, we say Dost doshtan, dost doshtan. Or in formal way would be to say nars didan, nars didan. Uh, literally, it means see you well, like in Avatar, the movie. I can see you. All right, the next is like. So in Tajik, we say ma kul, ma kul. And there is a in between ma kul, ma kul. So like would be ma kul. All right, our next word is the word beautiful. Beautiful in Tajik, we say khushru or zebo. Khushru is more common, I think, in the north part of Tajikistan. We use this word more compared to zebo. And khushru is less formal compared to zebo. And also, you can find a girl with this name, whose first name is zebo. And I have a friend, her name is zebo, and the meaning of this name is it's beautiful. So it's a beautiful name. So zebo and khushru means beautiful. Okay, next, honey or darling, dear. So in Tajik we say azizam. Azizam or jonam, sometimes jon. Jon means like life, like my life, joniman, or sometimes like a soul also. So azizam or jonam, sometimes jonakam, it depends. So something like that. Okay, next one is hug. Hug, in Tajik, we say ohosh. Ohosh is more formal. Not many people say ohosh here in the north part of Tajikistan. Um, we usually say achi. Achi is so informal. So formal would be to say ohosh or achi, as we say. All right, next one is kiss, the word kiss. In Tajik, we say busa. Busa is formal. Uh, usually we say muchi. Muchi is informal. And you don't really hear people saying that word busa or to kiss will be busidan. So muchi is more like common. Okay, the next word is heart. Heart, in Tajik, we say dil. Dil. My heart will be Diliman. Dil. Next, gift. A gift in Tajik will be tufa. Tufa. Uh, tufa. And there are some gifts that we usually buy uh, on Valentine's Day, like, for example, chocolate. Chocolate in Tajik, we say shakalat. It's the same word in Russian, they say shakalat. Some people say shakalot, but I checked, I spent some time doing the research and I found here they have an English and in Tajik description. So here they have batonche chocolade, chocolade. Uh, so yeah, chocolate will be chocolate. And uh, sometimes people prefer to buy something like this because it's the shape of it. It's like a heart, so it's more romantic, sweet and romantic at the same time. Or flowers. These are not real. So flowers, in Tajik, we say gu, gu. So, chocolate, 
gu, and a gift will be tuhfe. Okay, now let's learn some phrases in Tajik. How to say, for example, I like you. So you already know how to say like. If you remember, it's maqul. So if you say I like you in Tajik will be tu baman maqul. Tu baman maqul. And a bit informal way would be to say tu man ba maqul. So ba goes after man. So tu man ba maqul. That's how we say in the north part. But formal way, tu baman maqul. And another one, a stronger one, uh, I love you. I love you will be man turo dus medra. Turo is, if you remember from the pronouns, turo is like you, like younger. And shumo, when you respect that person or that person is older. So tu and shumo both mean you, but it depends on the person you are using with. So man turo dus medra. If you say shumo, man shumoro dus medra. And a bit informal way, the way we say here, man tuya. So instead of ro at the end of tu, not tu ro, but we say tuya. Man tuya dus med, uh, or man tuya nags mebina. Like I, I see you well. Man tuya nags mebina. So I like you, tu ba mamaku, and I love you, man tuya dus medram. Man tuya nags mebina. Like that. Okay, next is miss you. So miss in Tajik is yot kardam and miss you will be turo yot kardam. So I miss you. Man turo yot kardam. I miss you. Man turo yot kardam. And the last one, call me. So call me will be zang zan, zang zan. Or another way, more common way, um, telephone kun, telephone, like telephone, telephone kun. So, telephone kun or zangza. All right, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you learned something new and I hope you will use some of these words or phrases on February 14th. And uh, if you are watching this from Tajikistan or if you speak Tajik, please let us know in the comments how you use some of these words uh, in your area because it might be a bit different um, in some other parts of Tajikistan. So, thank you very much again for watching this video. And see you next week in the next video. Bye-bye.